presentation of TFNN. The Tom O'Brien Show is produced every business day. Tom takes your phone calls toll-free at 1-877-927-6648. Internationally at 727-873-7618. Hey, Robert, how you doing, man? Yes, and thank you for taking my call. I wanted to let you know that I've been a subscriber for a couple of years, just different members of your team, and I really enjoy it. But really the reason I'm calling is to express my sincerest gratitude for you providing that information information yesterday on the small business grant. I'm a small business owner and primary breadwinner for my family. And if I can get that money, it's going to really mean a lot to my family. So that's awesome. Thank you for uh, taking the time to do that. No, well, well, listen, man, we appreciate you growling a problem with us. Now, Tom O'Brien. <laughs> Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. Make it a great week, folks. Be impeccable with your word. Manifest your true intentions. Regardless of what language you speak, your intent will be manifested through the word. What you dream, what you feel, and what you really are will be manifested through what you say each and every day. Otherwise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials down 43, NASDAQ up 127, S&P's up 13 and a half, gold contract down $29.50, traded at 1924 an ounce. We had silver up 54 cents, 25 dollars seven cents an ounce. Light sweet crude, they're whacking that today down 850, 10531 a barrel. Notes and bonds, the 10 year note down up six ticks, 121.23. 30 year up 21 ticks at 147.23. And folks, after three weeks down, yeah, this is a, <laughs> it's an anemic bounce. But the bottom line is that uh, lower, lower prices, higher rates continue coming at us. King dollar. King dollar is up by 334 ticks, trading 99,124. Euro is trading out here at a price point of 109. The yen is at 123.62. That really got weak beyond belief overnight. And the British pound is trading at 130 to 1 US dollar. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Give us a call, folks. Want to know what's going on in your world? In the world of the S&P, this is about as deviant as you can get, folks. The, you got an ABC structure up. It took a B point out, took it out with volume. Guess what? These highs are game once again, as is the NDX 100. You know, inside the SPY, you're talking to like a price projection of 478. You're at 454. Inside the NQs, um, the, uh, the three Qs, rather, we're talking 391. And so this is a this is pretty deviant, no doubt. Let's get over to our man, Mr. Dave Mazda. Dave is the head of product and managing director at Direction Shares. Bottom line, you can go to our website at TFNN. You just hit that Direction banner. It brings you right over there. You get to understand the singles, the doubles, the triples. Bottom line, have a huge amount of great product. Dave Mazda, welcome back to TFNN. Hey, thanks for having me back. It's a pleasure. So, Dave, let's talk about, you know, we've had oil going in a big way, right? So what I'd love to talk about, two different ETFs you have out here. The, the ONG, okay, which is the daily, uh, um, you know, oil services. And then the MSRG, which is the, uh, um, you know, the ETF for, you know, this new technology. Maybe we can, can we talk about that one first, man? Because... This is, you know, folks, this is a brand new technology um, and they get a great, uh, you know, uh, ETF here, um, which is the, the, the symbol is MSGR. Dave? Yeah, so, yeah. yeah. Oh, uh, so. Can, can you hear me? Yes, I can. Yes. Great. Yeah. So uh, MSGR is a ETF based solely on biotechnology companies that are involved with the development of mRNA technologies. Right. So there's tw 21 names in the portfolio. There's probably only a handful of names that uh, traders may be familiar with. So that would mean Moderna and BioNTech. Uh, but there's actually a handful of other companies that are in the process of trying to commercialize mRNA as a technology, but applying it to other areas. And I think what's fascinating is 
for decades, mRNA was didn't receive any funding. Uh, very, you know, uh, people were kind of just uh, plowing away at it and not getting anywhere. And then one of the silver linings of the COVID-19 pandemic is that mRNA has been justified as uh, uh, as a technology, particularly as an effective and resilient uh, in vaccines. Um, so now, uh, just last week, Moderna uh, opened their their first ever human trial on an HIV. Um, uh, treatment based on mRNA. So the applications are really exciting and our fund is seeking to capitalize on uh, the amount of interest that has gone, gone into the space. And you know what's so cool about this, folks, okay, is that, and, and you know, Dave, you know, when we have something that's this new, you know, individuals, all of us, yeah, we could take a shot with this one and with that one and with this one. I like the idea that you have them all in one because we know in the biotech space, I mean, there's going to be blow ups, folks. So, well, you know, it's brand new. So it's really cool that you can get a basket. Right? I mean, you know, I, I'm a big believer in this technology. That's why when I saw this, that you have it, um, you know, when you actually read about it, it's it's going to change lives, man. I mean, it just, you know, there's, there has to be more research and all that, but it's going to change lives and it's basically saving lives. So pretty cool, man. And so the the, the uh, symbol focus is MSGR. So now let's let's go to the ONG where well, that's been getting some <laughs> big business. There's no doubt. And, you know, you can see, you know, oil is going wild today. That being said, you know, my, my take is that oil is still going higher. So it's like, OK, well, you know, we know how this goes. You can be right. You can be wrong, whatever. Uh, but when you take a look at this ONG, these companies are making money once again. Yeah, no, that's 100% correct. Yeah, so ONG is a newer ETF in our lineup. Uh, and it's really focused, the way I think about the difference of the names in that basket compared to uh, a, a gush yes. uh, and drip on that side, or even um, uh, e ERX, right? It's th These are the picks and shovels of the oil industry. Right. So these are the companies that are, they're called oil services and really again what that means is that they're the ones who are you know providing the, the equipment the, the drilling equipment the rigs maybe the people to operate it so they're not out searching for new wells or you know selling you know they don't have gas stations they're providing the tools to make the oil industry happen and to your point is whether we are you know a uh, hundred dollars a barrel 130 dollars a barrel when you when you move from you know maybe those those artificial lows of under you know uh, twenty five dollars thirty dollars through fifty these are the companies that start to see their revenue propel because you need new rigs you need to uh, reoperate something or buy more equipment um, so it's one of the, they have a very very high beta or sensitivity to the price of oil and I think that's one of the reasons why uh, traders have, have have found ONG uh, in in a short period of time since we launched it. Yeah, there's no doubt. And, you know, it's, it, it, Dave, it's always, you know, it's so intriguing to me. And it, because we go through these cycles, what ends up happening, folks, you know, oil is a boom and bust commodity cycle. It, it just happens on a continual basis. And it's amazing that these rigs could go for so much money, then go for nothing. And now we're back on going up again. I mean, it, it's huge, man. Well, listen, this is a pleasure, Dave. You have a great one, safe one. We look forward to speaking to you two weeks from today. Sounds good. We'll talk soon. Thank you. Stay right there, folks. We're coming right back. We have the Dow Industrials right now trading down 35. Nasdaq's up 138. S&P's up 15 and a half. We'll come right back. Are you looking for a way to consistently add winning trades to your portfolio? Tom O'Brien is here to help. Tom O'Brien has been successfully trading markets for over 30 years. A frequent contributor to TD Ameritrade Network and CNBC, Tom O'Brien founded TFNN over 20 years ago to help educate investors just like you. Tom's daily market newsletter, Market Insights, is published every morning when the markets open to give you the competitive informational edge you need to succeed. These newsletters are packed full of Tom's advanced technical analysis and are geared to deliver comprehensive strategies for a successful portfolio. Get Tom O'Brien's newsletter, Market Insights, today. And try all of our products and newsletters 30 days risk-free with our money-back guarantee at TFNN.com. TFNN, educating investors. What's separating you from the most successful men and women on Wall Street? That's right, information. Having all the information gives us the perspective we need to place the right trades at the right time. 
The TAS Profile Scanner is the premier market profile-based scanner. Powered by its acclaimed TAS proprietary algorithms, this feature-rich scanner instantly filters over 2,500-plus global financial markets, such as stocks, ETFs, commodities, futures, and Forex. This powerful suite of tools leverages instant trade filtering and strategy formulation to show you emerging trades before they happen. For a limited time, you can save $100 off your first month by using the promo code UPGRADE and you still get a 30-day money-back guarantee so you have nothing to risk. Level the playing field with the TAS Profile Scanner, which you can find under the Services tab at TFNN.com. Sign up today. Sharpening your skills as an investor is like getting better at playing a musical instrument. You have to practice, sure, but you also need excellent instruction from experts. At TFNN, you'll get advice and guidance from the authority in technical market analysis. And it's not just dry, tedious text, either. TFNN airs live financial content streamed live on TFNN.com and TFNN's YouTube channel with Tiger TV. Live every market day from 8.30 a.m. to 4 p.m. Eastern. For free, each host is an experienced trader and gives their take on the market while taking calls and questions live from around the world. From the moment the market opens until the closing bell sounds, Tiger TV has eight different shows with expert hosts to help you make the right moves with your money. Watch online at TFNN.com or on TFNN's YouTube channel and become the investor you were born to be. TFNN, educating investors. Call now, toll free at 1-877-927-6648. Internationally at 727-873-7618. Welcome back, folks. Uh, Dow. Dow Industrials are down 39. You get the NASDAQ up 136. S&Ps are up 15. Let's get over to our man, Mr. Steve Rhodes, as we do each and every Monday at 20 past the hour. And don't forget, folks, Steve has an outstanding show every trading day right here. 1 to 2 Eastern Standard Time. Also a great newsletter, Mastering Probability. Now, it's very easy to get Steve's newsletter, folks. Come over to our website at TFNN. You're going to hit newsletters. You're going to see it right on the right-hand side. You just hit subscribe you can get steve's newsletter for one month for 149 dollars you can get it for uh three months for 690 six months rather for 695 which is a savings of 199 dollars uh, or 22 percent and you can get it for the year for 1195 which is a savings of 593 dollars or 33 percent now they all come with a 30-day money back guarantee folks so check it out this is a great trading market there's no doubt uh, Steve Rhodes, what's going on? <laughs> well, Tom, uh, around lunchtime today, I was at the eye doctor this morning, and the uh, you know, hey, you should fill up, you should you should add some gas to your car. Light came on, so it wasn't totally empty. Yeah, you know, but was you know below a quarter of a tank probably. Hundred and seventeen bucks. There you go. To fill up. You get you got a tank that's over twenty gallons. I like it. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> and and so the other the other crazy thing, I I go back and forth to Naples pretty often these days. Yeah, and. Uh, and I know, uh, and, and yesterday, so I, I had to fill up before I left, or I, I put gas in before I left, and uh, and I paid uh, five sixty, I think was the was the price. And then when I got to Naples, is where I really filled up, yeah. and it was seventy cents a gallon cheaper. Yeah, the, see over here, it's I, we're it's we're crazy we're, at, we're at four ninety, right, right, yeah. Uh, which is, you guys you know, have more it. money on your coast anyway, so. No, 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 that's not <laughs> it. <laughs> I, David was telling me that it's because you guys have got some depots over there. So the transportation costs, but still 70 but, cents a gallon. Uh, it's yeah. it's heavy, Second. man. It's it's going to hit people. There's no doubt about it, man. Yeah, yeah there's no doubt. So I thought today we'd take a little bit of a look at the big picture, okay. maybe a smaller picture as well. And so to start off with the big picture, I'd like to start with this chart here. Tell people to understand really about the global flow of capital, capital flee in Europe, wherever it might flee and where it might go to. So if we take a look at the highs of 2000, we'd be looking at the left-hand side of the chart. And up in the upper portion, we're looking at the Euro-US dollar. I don't think I have the charts. Oh, there we go. I have them. Thank you. Okay, I got them. We got them. Okay, perfect. Yep. Perfect. So from, from on the upper left-hand side, yeah. uh, what we've got out here is uh, we have the euro falling, capital fleeing Europe, and moving into the that, – that was, that was one of the elements that really helped our markets move higher into 2000. I know they call it the dot-com bubble, but it's still capital was fleeing from Europe. It was coming into the U.S. That helped to push markets higher. We have that same pattern 
uh, that has been going on since 2009. Again, the upper right-hand portion of the uh, top portion of this chart, the euro moving lower, really started moving lower as soon as in June when the ECB moved to negative interest rates. And that's actually when the U.S. stock market really took off to the upside. It was already moving higher, but boy, once those negative interest rates, we had capital fleeing Europe, moving into the U.S. So just important for people to understand that picture out here. Now, the same in pattern, like I say, has been unfolding uh, since 2009. If the euro busts through the 2016 lows, now because I'm using a line chart here, this is the closing price of the euro, and I'm using a monthly time frame chart. If you look at candlesticks, you'll see the price got lower than the buck five that's uh, shown here. But on a closing basis, if the euro breaks through these lows out here, uh, that is then going to send a significant amount of capital into the U.S. So just trying to give people the bigger picture, Tom. Yes. Uh, and it's really important for us to, to to take a look at the euro. And so speaking of the euro. And this is a monthly time frame chart. When the euro topped in 2008, so going back to our markets moving higher, the euro topped in 2008, capital fleed, fled uh, Europe into US stocks. Uh, it was a TD9 count pattern, this is blue arrow across the top, that identified that top. If we take a look at coming into January of 2021, it was another TD9 count top that had formed out there. So again, capital coming out of Europe into the US. Now. We fast forward to today, where I've got this blue arrow, bottom portion of my screen here. This month, the month of uh, March, is going to become bar number eight of a TD9 count. Now, in the case of TD9 counts, they can top with bar number eight, much like it did back in the 2008 time frame, or it can be bar number nine or the bar following nine. But this is setting up, as long as the euro holds, I'd say the 104 to 107 level, this would suggest that uh, there may be a bounce or a bottom. And that bounce or bottom for the euro, Tom, should take it up into this 114 ish level this little green red line that's what i refer to as the oscillator unchanged line and when it changes colors especially when there's a top or bottom being made that is typically where price will go ahead and gravitate itself to so at this stage right now i would say at the end of march it looks like the euro might be might save itself at this stage but look if it takes out those lows at a buck four out there then uh, you know then all heck is going to break loose and we'll see uh, money come into the uh, u.s stock market so they may be on pause. The euro may be on pause. Now, if we then take a look at our U.S. markets, we take a look at the Dow. The Dow has a yearly TD9 count top. Remember I said when we were looking at the euro, the top of a TD9 count can happen on either bars 8, bar 9, or the bar following. In this case here for the Dow, it's the bar following 9. That's on a yearly basis. So we've got that top that's in place out here. On a monthly basis, this triggered a road's momentum indicator signal. So we've got that top from a monthly standpoint. The weekly standpoint, we have wave number 7. That's an element of Basil Chapman's Chapman wave out there. So that's a top. And again, on the daily time frame now, we've got a TD9 count bottom that is formed. So that's important to take a look at. But when we come down below and take a look at the daily time frame chart here for the Dow Equity Future contract, where the Dow Cash does not have a TD9 count top, we do have one in place here for the Dow Equity Future contract. So at this stage here, um, we may be seeing a short-term top that forms relatively soon. And when I say relatively soon, uh, well, here's here's the Dow weekly chart. So the, 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 the bear side is that we get a TD9 count and we see price pull back. The bullish side is we take a look at uh, really one of Bud Rolf's charts, so to speak. Here we've got horizontal trading ranges. Those are the green horizontal lines. It's a weekly chart that we're looking at for the Dow. And then we've got our diagonal trend channels out here. And the cool thing is, Tom, when you create the trend channel coming off the 2009 low to the March uh, 20, uh, 2009 low, and then you can clearly see the highs out here, all I do is I just take that width of that. And then it just simply increases by that same width to get these dash lines out here. So interestingly enough, when you get through one area, you then move on to the next area. So if we take a look at where the Dow topped, it was topping into a horizontal trading range, into a rising trend line. But right now, as long as the Dow holds 34.152, that's the price that people should be looking at. It could be signaling that the markets move higher, but the daily time frame has these topping signals. So that takes us back to the S&P 500. And if we look at the S&P 500 here on the daily basis, today is going to become bar number nine, whether it's for the cash indice or whether it's for the daily time frame. That says we could see the high occur tomorrow could be today or tomorrow that high can form a bars eight nine or the bar following nine this might just be a pullback or retracement this would be your devious thing here because yeah. you're thinking hey the markets might move higher well we might have a short-term top as we talked about before when we get those top or bottom signals price typically pulls back into that oscillator and change line so move back to 44.10 would be normal 
it would could be the next entry point to the to the to the uh, to a move higher out here. But we do have, or I do have, some short-term topping signals. Now, the real levels for folks to be watching at overnight. So I'll get right to the point here. If this is a top, we're going to see levels get broken, support levels. These blue arrows show us where these are breakout levels on a 30-minute time frame for the ES Mini. These are where the buy the dips were. But if price closes below one of those, that tells us we've got some type of change in character or trend in the market. So the level to be watching overnight and the level to be watching tomorrow right now is 4504.50 in the ES Mini. Close below that, that'll give us a signal to the downside. It's, it, isn't this amazing? I mean, it, it, listen, it's blowing my mind. I think it's going back to the highs, but I don't think it's going to hit the highs. And if yeah. it, we just underneath them, it's like unreal. unreal. Check, yeah, it, check out Steve's newsletter, folks. Thanks, Tom. Maximum probability, TFNN. Have a great one, Steve. Have a safe one. Are you having fun trading the markets but having trouble finding like-minded individuals to discuss your trading and investment ideas with? Become an apex predator in the trading markets and join the Tiger's Den Trading Room only at TFNN.com. The Tiger's Den is an exclusive trading room where successful traders from around the world come to exchange trades and ideas. Join the den and surround yourself with the sharpest minds in the trading world. Subscribers to the Tiger's Den are also the first to have their questions answered live on air and can privately chat with our TFNN hosts live during their shows. Interact with other Tigers and Tigresses as they share trading ideas, news analysis, and discuss the market action all trading day. Subscribe to the Tiger's Den risk-free with our 30-day money-back guarantee and become part of the TFNN trading community. TFNN, educating investors. You could be making money off the stock market. And if you're already making money off the stock market, you could be making a lot more. Check out TFNN and Tiger TV and get expert investing advice to give you the power to control your financial future. Go to TFNN.com and find the newsletter for you. Whether you're into trading gold, metals, futures, currencies, or options, you'll get advice and analysis to help you seriously get ahead. TFNN also features trading services with a 30-day money-back guarantee for new subscribers, as well as TFNN's Tiger Den Trading Room, trading software, and educational webinars for all trading levels and make sure you check out tiger tv for free on tfnn.com or tfnn's youtube channel for live financial content from 8 30 a.m to 4 p.m eastern on market days stop watching on the sidelines while other people get rich and become the investor you were born to be tfnn educating investors TFNN is excited about our new software charting program, The Art of Timing the Trade Charts. In collaboration with Tom O'Brien and using his best-selling book, The Art of Timing the Trade, Your Ultimate Trading Mastery System, David White has programmed an outstanding piece of software that will complement any trader's methodology. Using this first-of-its-kind program, The Art of Timing the Trade Charts allows you to scan thousands of stocks for Fibonacci formation setups, including Gartley's, ABC's, Butterflies, and much more. The Art of Timing the Trade Charts is designed to help you when scouring the markets for stocks just beginning to form the trading patterns that many investors spend days, weeks, or even months searching to find. And right now, we're offering licenses available at only $79 a month. We are so confident that you're going to love this new charting software that will even give you a 30-day unconditional money-back guarantee. Don't miss out on this incredible new piece of software. Get your copy of The Art of Timing the Trade Charts today by visiting TFNN.com. This segment is brought to you by Think or Swim. For more information, just click the Think or Swim banner on the front page of TFNN.com. Welcome back, folks. Uh, Dow. Dow's uh, down 15. You get the NASDAQ up 150. S&Ps are up uh, 18 and a half. Let's just go over to the Dow Industrials and take a look. What you're going to see there, you rejected the lower price out here today. Bottom line is that uh, you're moving higher once again. Um, these are all ABC. Well, we haven't. Uh, let me just look at this. I'm going to show you the key, the spies right now on the cell. So, yeah, the, the Dow just doesn't have volume. That being said, though, we get over to the spy. Here, I'll show you these ABCs because the bottom line, the cool, this is what the cool thing is about these ABCs, folks. OK, if you understand the ABC structure, they're straight line moves. You know, and we're coming into window dressing. This is lining up just perfectly to make a real run. So the bottom line is that, you know, you, you 
we fri well, this is what ended up happening on Friday. On Friday, we got a huge amount of volume at the close, and that's what did it, okay? Uh, bottom line is that we have uh, 77 million shares taken out 74. So you have a price projection there of uh, $478. Well, the bottom line is that the, the high is 479.90, and the exact number here is 478.50. So if you're trading something like this, this is the cool thing here, folks, okay? Yes, can it get into a complex one and go underneath the B point? Yeah, it can. But if you were trading this and you were looking for some trades, the way that I would do this, where is that? Why is this giving me a hard time? No. There we go. So the way that I would do this is you can see the, the B point is 450.58. The bottom line is just put a stop underneath it. And you're gunning for the basically a 478. That's how he's shaking it out. Now, if I go over to the NQs, this is what uh, Dan the man showed me this morning with the volume. We didn't get the volume in the Qs, but we did get the volume inside the NASDAQ futures. Okay, so that's, that's better than not getting the volume. Let's put it that way, okay? So what you're gonna see here is that we got volume out here of 554,000 contracts, uh, bottom line versus uh, 510,000. So that baby is set up to not quite get to the highs, but right next to them, you know? And that would be, to me, that would be the most deviant thing the market could do because um, you got everything going against this market and it has been going against it for a while. But this would be the more, this is the, this is, this is the deviant move, man. You get interest rates going through the roof. The bottom line is that that's where I think we're going. Um, let's go take a look at uh, SLVO. Now, this is a, an equity that uh, operates on covered calls. So let's see what we got here. This is the Credit Suisse Covered Call ETN, an exchange traded note issued in the U.S. The ETN tracks the return of covered call strategy of the iShares Silver Trust. Oh, interesting. The ETN pays a monthly variable coupon based on the, 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 uh, the option premiums received from the sale of the covered calls. Interesting. This is interesting. Okay, so let me see this thing. So they're selling. I'm trying to figure out holdings. Okay, I don't have the holdings. I'm trying to figure out whether they're selling covered calls. Oh, the ICS Silver Trust. Okay, so this is just based on the, uh, so this is strictly based on um, the price of silver. So let's bring this back a little. And, okay, so let me do it this way. Look at this again. So I want to look at the, this is the ICS Silver Trust. Let's bring that up, SLV. Okay, so we bring the SLV up. I'm just curious to how much premium they're getting um, into, okay, so we're 22.97. So they sell covered calls. Let's just see what they're getting for these things. The cool thing inside the silver market is that they, they can get some big premiums going, there's no doubt. Okay, so let's see, if you're selling get a little more strikes here I want I'm gonna do 25 strikes okay okay so no. a dollar okay so 22 f man they're not getting a lot of premium here you know I guess, uh, you know, look at, looking at that, I'd be a little careful because what, what you're saying there, particularly because I, I know that Tiger, you know, is in the gold and silver market, um, because what you're saying here is this, is that when you sell a covered call, they're great to do, but you have to be okay with it getting called away. And... When I take a look at what those premiums are in the SLV, that doesn't seem to be enough because to me, silver wants to go to 30 bucks. And right now you're trading 24.99. You know, so you can, you're getting, picking up, you know, 30 cents, 20 cents and all that. Yeah, I, I, 
I wouldn't be on that side of the market, meaning that if you are in the gold or silver market, folks, and you, what you should be doing is that you're buying dips, you're selling rips, and you don't go shot when the rips are happening. You know, I, I've seen, well, I've seen plenty of money lost and plenty of money made, but I've seen plenty of money lost um, <laughs> shotting the gold and silver market. That's the bottom line. Because it takes off just when you don't think it's going to take off. And it just gets blown away in about two seconds. So I'd, I'd be careful with that. That's the bottom line. We got, let's go take a look at the NASDAQ composite. Well, actually, let's look at the NDX 100 first because the whole, th this is set up like coming at the window dress in a monster way. We got, uh, we got uh, this is uh, OKTA, that's up uh, 8%. You get Tesla up 7.5%. Um, you get Mercado Libre up five and a half, taken away from it. Uh, well, O'Reilly Automotive is down two and a half. Pindoradu is off 1.3. Let's go to O'Reilly for a second. You know, because O'Reilly, this has been like going up forever. Um, yeah, it's in a consolidation. Okay, so bring this back. Put this on a weekly. Yeah, this still wants higher price, man. <laughs> Pretty intense. So if we go take a look at the composite the nasdaq composite see how this baby is setting up yeah this is <laughs> this is pretty clear man it's taking it's taking the consolidation out wow this is gonna be like, so strange yeah this one's higher price man um and if we go take let me pull up the volume today and see what we're gonna get you're at 4.2 right now yeah you're not gonna get a lot of volume some of the higher volume equities in this market right now that are moving around. Get that S&P up here. Where is that? There you go. Okay, so you got AMC. Look at this up, 795. Oh my God. As the, as the, so AMC is up. They're saying as the more strategic deals. He's gonna, he's getting himself uh, out of the movie business, but he's using all that cash, folks, to uh, basically do some other business. Stay, stay right there, folks. Dow's gonna go green. They're running into the close, man. Are you in the market for buying or selling real estate in the Bay Area, including the surrounding St. Petersburg, Tampa, and Clearwater markets? Tiger Real Estate LLC is a firm that has extensive experience in the Tampa Bay Area. Whether you're looking to sell your current property for maximum value, or you're in the market for a second home or investment property, Tiger Realty has the experience across all areas of real estate in the Tampa Bay Area to help buyers and sellers make the most informed decisions across all price levels. From the price you should be paying per square foot in certain up-and-coming areas to the type of cash flow investment properties are capable of creating, Tiger Real Estate can help you make the best decision when it comes to all areas of the market. Before you make one of the biggest decisions of your financial future, call Tiger Real Estate LLC today at 727-329-8322 or email us at tiger at tfnn.com. That's 727-329-8322. Call us today. technology around us is changing every day. With so much happening, it can seem impossible to keep up with all the information. David White's investment newsletter, The Technology Insider, is designed to give you all the information you need to understand the technology that shapes today's markets and tomorrow's future. David White has made his living staying on the cutting edge of technology. His weekly newsletter will give you specific recommendations for value tech stocks, as well as entry prices, target prices, and stops to set for each trade. Dave delivers his weekly newsletters every Friday with updates throughout the week. You can get the Technology Insider at TFNN.com for only $37.50. Sign up for David's newsletter, The Technology Insider, and get an inside look at everything the technology sector has to offer. Try it risk-free today with our 30-day money-back guarantee. TFNN, educating investors.
biotech is booming, but for how long? Whether you think the biotech bull has room to run or has run its course, trade LABU or LABD. Direction's daily S&P Biotech three times bull and bear ETFs. Visit directioninvestments.com slash biotech today. An investor should consider the investment objectives, risks, charges, and expenses of the Direction shares carefully before investing. The prospectus and summary prospectus contain this and other information about Direction shares. To obtain a prospectus or summary prospectus, please contact Direction shares at 866-476-7523. The prospectus or summary prospectus should be read carefully before investing. An investment in the funds is subject to risk, including the possible loss of principal. The funds are designed to be utilized only by sophisticated investors, such as traders and active investors. Distributor Foresight Fund Services, LLC. Call now, toll free at 1-877-927-6648. Internationally at 727-873-7618. I'm O'Brien. Welcome back, folks. Uh, Dow. Dow Industrials right now are trading uh, down two. NASDAQ is up 147. S&Ps are up 20. And, folks, as you come over to our website at TFNN, you're going to see right under the front page, free to content. Tiger's Den Trading Room. Now, we've always had a trading room. Um, this one here, what we have done is this. We transferred from using Hotcom to Discord. And, you know, it's fabulous. Um, bottom line, we'd love to see all the tigers and tigresses in there. It's only a dollar a year. We're charging the dollar so we don't have spam and all of this, okay? You'll really enjoy it. There's a lot of great tigers and tigresses in there. We already got over about 120 right now. Um, I expect we're gonna have a lot more. I know we're gonna have a lot more. There's great ideas. You know, if you want a nice community that basically help each other, check it out on the front page. There's no strings attached. It's a buck. That's the bottom line. We just want to put people together so they can make, so they have the probability of making more money. Let's go to Dave in Boston. Hey, Dave, what's going on? Good afternoon, Tom. That sounds like a great idea. I'll be uh, I'll be in on that. That's a beautiful. We appreciate that, man. Because the, the, the way well, this works, the more ideas, the better off it is, folks. That's the bottom line. So, and it's active. There you go. It's pretty cool, man. You know, appreciate it. I'm 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 one of the Daves from Boston, by the sounds of it. But anyways, uh, hey, I wanted to ask you about LNG. It looks it had some it had a strong leg up. It gets some sharp pullbacks, again, which it's had today. Um, do you look like, does that look to you as though it's in a, uh, a C to D leg? Let's look at it. So uh, it's LNG, Chenier Energy. Uh, the lows, $70. The highs, $149. Uh, right now it's trading at $140. Okay, so this is, uh, they own and operate liquefied natural gas terminals uh, and pipelines. Do they own boats too? No, okay, at least they have the terminals and pipelines, okay, which is crucial. Okay, so let's take a look at this. I'm gonna put this first, I wanna see this on a weekly and see where we're at. Okay, so I see that, so we took that out. I'm gonna, I'm gonna change, I'm gonna put this on a monthly now, Dave, all right, because all right, yeah. The, the weekly wasn't that clear. Okay, so the monthly, you got an ABC up. Oh, this is a big ABC up. Man, I'd be buying dips, yeah. Okay, so you got 113. Oh, man. Pretty intense. 27. Like, yeah, I'd buy every dip, dip you could find on this. I mean, that where, would the, where would you project it to? This is going to, so I got... You got 177. You got 177 yeah, to right. 180, man. That's all how right. this. And what you have here, folks, okay, um, you know, the, the, the bottom line is that this is liquefied natural gas, and we are going to be sending gas everywhere, man. So, yeah. Uh, so now let's just okay. look at it daily. So it's down nine bucks today. So now the question is. You got it inside? had some pretty sharp pullbacks on the uh, yeah the leg from like a hundred to one forty whatever. Yeah, no, for and, sure. And 
you know, it's just had some, today was a sharp pullback. It is. And you know what I do here? I mean, if you can get this at 127, I think this, you know, this has gone up so far. And we just like I said, okay, we know natural gas is going to, we need more natural gas, all of the above. And this will be about as deep as you can get. It, it'll probably come back to the lower end of this consolidation. And right. if you can get it there, man, that'll be a great buy because, you know, six months from now, that 170, 180 is probably in, man. Um, yeah. Gotcha. You know, this is all, so check this out, folks. Okay, when we start talking PEs, this is only, you're paying $10 for a dollar worth of earnings, man. This is only 10 to 1. Right. <laughs> yeah. You know. Yeah, I know it's relatively inexpensive that way, yep. Yeah, it really is. So, but, uh, I think, you I think you're onto something there, man. <laughs> yeah. Hey, thank you very much, Tom. I appreciate it. Okay, man, have a great one. Have a safe one. Uh, that was Chenier Energy, folks, okay, in the, in the market of, uh, um, you know, natural gas and, you know, in the m market of uh, pipelines. And what we are going to see, we are going to see a huge amount of natural gas come from here and bottom line going over to Europe. So they uh, basically, <laughs> it, blow, it, it actually blows my mind that, the Europeans actually, well, particularly in Germany, signed up to have Russia have 40% of their natural gas, meaning that but they buy 40% off them. That's like, I, I don't even understand how that could have happened, but it is what it is. Well, I, you know what I expect? I expect what would probably happen is that you get a couple large corporations, and the corporations paid off the dues um, to all the politicians, and that's how the deal got done, and take everyone to the cleaners. More than likely, that's what we had. But let's go inside the Dow Industrials and take a look. Uh, you know what brought the Dow back today because the Dow was down 250 bucks earlier. Microsoft's a big mover out here. Well, let's go point wise and see what we have. Point wise, yeah, it's still Microsoft. Microsoft putting 40 positive points. Salesforce 24, Home Depot 20, uh, Walmart 16. Taken away from it, uh, Chevron minus 22. You get Goldman minus 17. Caterpillar minus 11. Um, you know, so we'll, we'll see where this uh, baby wants to go. But right now, my take is that as we come into window dressing, this thing wants to go to highs. That's how this thing is setting up. And you can see what it's doing, man. I mean, when I started on the air, so look, look, just watch these futures for a second. This is like wild, man. But this is what's so cool. So when you are used to ABC structures, folks, you have a different confidence in them when you've seen them so much and they don't always work there's not even it's not even close okay the bottom line maybe 70 75 percent i really don't have the number but i do know this is that they're one of the most consistent patterns that basically i trade you know so you know when they fail big time big deal they fail uh, but in this particular case the reason i'm so confident with it is that it's so deviant it's the most deviant thing you can do you get interest rates going up, you get a wall going on, the market's too high anyway, the PEs are through the roof. Uh, it's like the perfect situation. Bring the market all the way back up again. And guess what? That'll suck more people into the marketplace, there's no doubt. But you can see when I just came on, okay, so the bottom line, you know, that was the first acceleration up, was just taking over the high. You can see that, see that ex expansion of volume right there in the futures at 10 of two, uh, t yeah, 22, you had 26,000 contracts. Next one, 38, uh, 28,000 contracts. That took out the high. The bottom line, you could just take the top of that, which is the 45, 47. You can take the bottom of that, which is the 45, 09. Yeah, and you can basically add another 40 points to that. Pfft. Yeah, this thing wants higher price, man. And yeah. Deviance beyond belief. There's no doubt about it. And we'll see, you know, we're talking about window dressing. What's going to be intriguing here in the window dressing is this. You can see gold's down big. And that with, with that gold down big, is that's all about the yen. The yen got so weak, it's unbelievable. The equities, however, are not getting hit. Because the market doesn't believe anyway yet that this is going to stay low. So what we're going to see this month is that how many sectors are these money managers going to basically come into? And how are they going to do it? My take is that we're going to be going higher. The real question is, though, what sectors are they actually going into? 
Stay right there, folks. Come right back. Sharpening your skills as an investor is like getting better at playing a musical instrument. You have to practice, sure, but you also need excellent instruction from experts. At TFNN, you'll get advice and guidance from the authority in technical market analysis. And it's not just dry, tedious text, either. TFNN airs live financial content streamed live on TFNN.com and TFNN's YouTube channel with Tiger TV. Live every market day from 8.30 a.m. to 4 p.m. Eastern for free. Each host is an experienced trader and gives their take on the market while taking calls and questions live from around the world. From the moment the market opens until the closing bell sounds, Tiger TV has eight different shows with expert hosts to help you make the right moves with your money. Watch online at TFNN.com or on TFNN's YouTube channel and become the investor you were born to be. TFNN, educating investors. You might think that if you want to be successful at trading in the stock market, you're going to need a crystal ball. After all, it's impossible to predict the future, right? Like any endeavor in life, before you decide it's impossible, get some advice from the experts. You might find that it's not so impossible after all. For daily market overviews that give you direction on the key indices, selective stocks, and commodities, subscribe to the opening call newsletter at TFNN.com. The opening call newsletter is written by Basil Chapman, creator of the trading methodology known as the Chapman Wave. The Chapman Wave up-down sequence gives you an edge in identifying price turns, finding the peaks and valleys in stock prices. Get the opening call newsletter by Basil Chapman in your inbox every day. First-time subscribers also get a 30-day money-back guarantee. If you're not satisfied, let us know, and you'll get a full refund within 30 days of signing up. TFNN.com, educating investors. Are you looking for a secured investment which pays you on a monthly basis? The Tiger First Mortgage Program may be the program for you. The best rate on a five-year CD in the country right now, according to Bankrate.com, is paying 1% per year or $1,000 per $100,000 invested. The Tiger First Mortgage Program pays 7% per year, paid monthly, on secured, high-value, buildable properties in St. Petersburg, Florida. The investment is for four years, paying 7% per year or $7,000 per $100,000 invested. Your investment is secured by high-value real estate in St. Petersburg, Florida. Your investment can be anywhere from $100,000 to $500,000. Do you want to make $1,000 per year on $100,000 invested or $7,000 per year on a secured Tiger First Mortgage? The Tiger First Mortgage Program may be just the program for you. The Tiger First Mortgage Program pays 7% per year paid monthly. For more information, you can call 877-518-9190. That's 877-518-9190. Don't forget, you can listen to TFNN live on your mobile device 24 hours per day. Go to TFNN.com, then hit Watch Tiger TV. That's TFNN.com, then hit Watch Tiger TV. Welcome back, folks. Uh, look at this. <laughs> Amazing. Dow's up 25, Nasdaq's up 147, S&Ps are up 22. I uh, just can't keep it down, folks. Uh, bottom line, uh, let's take a look at volume-wise out here. Inside the NYSE, oh, it's going to be shot volume too, man. We're only at 581 right now. You did 900 on Friday. It'd be going to be, that's going to be about 800 and something. Uh, so you're contracting with volume. Inside the composite, you're at 4.5, 5.5 on Friday. That's also going to contract. And that would make sense, by the way. See, we still took the B point out. You had the volume on the B point. Bottom line, I think it's going to go up to this, die all the way up. And there's going to be some other reason news wise that we think we should buy the market but i think that's going to be it man that's that's how this seems to be setting up uh don't forget about the tiger's den folks okay you come over to our website at tfnn we bring that we bring this up okay so come over to our website at tfnn you are going to see right on the front page okay tiger's den trading room okay under feature content it's only a dollar one dollar gets you the whole year one dollar is going to get you a great community of tigers and tigresses. You can talk to them. The den is active. Uh, good. Well, we're definitely active at 6.30, 7 o'clock in the morning uh, till 4 in the afternoon. There's a lot of tigers that are in there at night. But the bottom line, well, not but. The bottom line is you want some great trading ideas. You want a good community because it's a great community we have in there. Um, so check it out. We want everyone to be comfortable. We want people to make money. And we're going to do the most that we can in order to facilitate, facilitate 
everyone's ideas, get them in a place, you know, because when, you, when people do bring it up, it's a lot easier having a lot of eyes on the market, having other people understand fundamentals, other people standing technicals, you have it all inside that den. And always remember, folks, the bear can claw your heart out, the bull can run you over, and thank God there's always another trade. Health happens in prosperity. Have a great night. Have a safe night. Come back and visit Tommy tomorrow morning. He kicks us off 9 o'clock in the morning. Great show. Have a great one, folks. Have a safe one. Look at him run this market. Look at him, folks.